Welcome! In this video, we will show how Metadrug can be used for compound comparison of three anti-Alzheimer's drugs, including Rivastigmine, Tacrine, and Dinepazil. These drugs have the same primary mechanism of action. They all inhibit acetylcholinesterase. However, with such diverse chemical structures, these compounds are likely to have different effects in the body. Let's use Metadrug to explore them. To start, Use the compound activity workflow to upload an SDF file containing the three drugs and set the similarity threshold to 0.65. Once the reports are calculated, you may find them in the My Structures folder after refreshing the Start page. Next, activate the reports and launch the Compare Compounds workflow. At this step, first specify intersection settings, hit the Apply button, then select the desired intersection. In the first step, Metadrug determines the intersection of the targets found for the three compounds through the similarity search to identify unique and common targets. In the second step, these targets are subjected to functional analysis to identify the pathways and processes that may be affected by the compounds. For example, the Jingo disease by biomarkers ontology suggests Alzheimer's disease, tauopathies, and dementia as possible indications for the drugs based on their common targets indicated by the hatched or striped bars. We can also see that the unique targets of all three compounds, marked by individual colored bars, are also enriched in these categories, which may imply more than one mechanism of action for these compounds. To explore this further on the pathway level, let's look at the Jingo pathway maps. From the Jingo pathway ontology, the orange bar shows that the anandamide biosynthesis in metabolism pathway is unique for rivastigmine. Upon opening the map, we see that fatty acid amide hydrolase is a unique target for rivastigmine, which catalyzes the reaction of anandamide degradation, reducing its pool in the cells. Therefore, inhibition of the enzyme by rivastigmine can result in the accumulation of anandamide. Clicking on anandamide on the map takes us to the compound page. This page shows that it activates cannabinoid receptors, which were suggested as potential targets for Alzheimer's disease treatment. Unique processes related to denapazil, marked by the blue bar, can also be explored further, including neurophysical processes in cell hyperpolarization and excitability. All information from this page can be saved for future reference by exporting a report. This report includes compounds, the compound targets, the enrichment analyses, the most significant maps, and further description of all applied algorithms. Thank you for your attention.